Hey, Zach, what's going on, man? Uh, nuts going on. How's it going? Doing good, doing good. Um, kind of just wanted to ask you a couple questions about you being in Philadelphia. Um, yeah. Big fan, by the way. Big fan. I'm a big fan of your play. Um, Thank you. The way that you uh, carry yourself on the ice. Um, but um, just wondering how the city of Philadelphia was treating you. So oh, far. it's great. I mean, you know, I was it was I was living in Jersey there for the first month or so until I got uh, you know found a place. But um, you know, got a place downtown Philly now, and uh, you know, love this spot. You know, I'm loving the city. Some there's lots of good food and stuff around, and you know, the city's buzzing. So uh, you know, I'm liking it a lot. Yeah, it's uh, it's a good city. It's full of history, culture, and yeah, a lot of good food. Yeah, a lot of good food. What would you say about uh, is the fan base a little bit different than uh, than, than Vancouver? Would you say? Uh, yeah, I would say for sure. Um, you know, I think uh, you know they respect the uh, you know the kind of blue collar, the, the gritty aspects of the game a little bit more. Um, you know, I think. You know, I think that's, you know, that's why it's such a good fit for me here. You know, they, uh, you know, I really feel the love from them, uh, you know, the, in the way I play. And, and, you know, it's, you know, it's a great fan base. Like you can, you, I can tell from the first time I played here, um, you know, just the, the electricity in that burn and, and uh, you know, just, you know, just the, the energy that they bring every game is, uh, you know, it's awesome. Yeah, it's, it's definitely the type of uh, game. Uh, you know, Wayne Simmons is is a big name in this town, and he's kind of a doesn't really deal with a, a lot of the things on the ice. Throws the gloves down, lets lets people know he's in the building. The the, uh, the other game where you kind of rev the crowd up. It's been a long time since I think uh, the Flyers uh, fan base has seen someone with that kind of intensity, which I personally <laughs> love. Um, but um, yeah, so actually, I wonder. I don't, I don't have too much here for you. I know you're on a time constraint. Um, so you start off in Amherst with the Ramblers, Montauk with the Wildcats, a little stint in Gatineau at the Olympics, uh, Utica Comets, Vancouver Canucks, and now you're with the Flyers. If Zach McEwen in 2021 could give Zach McEwen in 2013 any advice, what would it be? <laughs> um, I don't know, man. That's a that's a tough question. Uh, I would say. I would say don't get discouraged probably. Um, you know, there's definitely setbacks that you, that you get along the way and, you know, it's, you know, it worked out for me along the way, but, uh, you know, there's times where you can doubt yourself, I guess, but, um, you know, I'd say just keep that, uh, keep that belief in yourself. That's great for all. I know my, I have two daughters I'm trying to, trying to get both of them. Uh, they're a little young right now. My five-year-old loves the flyers, loves hockey, trying to get that, instilled in her maybe to play i i played a little bit but not anywhere near a competitive level whatsoever um but um have you had have you had any uh interesting run-ins with gritty <laughs> you know what i haven't even met gritty yet really <laughs> i've been here i've been here over two months and i haven't even met him yet I, my girlfriend saw him in one of the games she was at and she got to high five him and she came up to me she's like i got to high five gritty so she was pretty pumped about that, but uh, no, I haven't. I haven't uh, got to see him yet. I think he'll probably make his way to you at some point. Yeah, he's the feisty one, that guy. Um, and uh, I have, I got one more thing for you. Like I said, I didn't want to keep you too long. You know, um, you got into a little uh, fisticuff with uh, Luke Shen. Yeah, you got, you got, kind of got your hand stuck in his visor. <laughs> um, I have never seen that before. Um, I've never Obviously done that, that before. <laughs> was, right. I was going to say, uh, I'm sure it was a mistake. Um, how was that? I mean, I think that, is that sharp or is that something? Uh, I mean, you know, sometimes in a fight, man, you, you kind of just grab on to whatever you can get a hold of whenever, you know, you got a big guy you're staring down and, and you know, you're kind of swinging and, and trying to hold on to something. So, uh, I would say that was just kind of accidental and, um, you know, it's not something that like I, I want to do again. <laughs> like it's, yeah, yeah it definitely, it definitely messed my hand up. Um, you know, it's not really, you know, obviously I got an extra penalty for that and, you know, it's not something you want to do in a fight, but you know, sometimes it's, you kind of just, you kind of lose control and it's, uh, you know, it's tough to, to kind of, you know, know what's going on there or, or grab on to, to something. So you kind of just do whatever you can. 
Yeah, I hear you. I hear you. I, I kind of grew up in the same kind of kind of mentality, but I didn't know if it was obviously it wasn't on purpose or it wasn't, you know, something you just got to go with the flow when you're in the heat of battle, I guess. Yeah, um, for sure. And by, by the way, I'm a huge, huge fan of yours. Yeah, not trying man, to do the fanboy thing, but um, <laughs> it's all good. I love it. I appreciate it. I'm pretty active on Twitter. And I, uh, what was that the other night? Your mom was saying how proud of you she was the other night. And I kind of <laughs> had a couple, had a couple words for her. She's great. Yeah. Yeah. She loves that stuff. She gets more fired up than me. So <laughs> yeah, I don't know where everybody got that gift of you uh, pumping the crowd up real quick. That was like instantaneous. Yeah. I don't know how that happened, but uh, yeah. yeah, you were on there pretty quick. Yeah, that's not something I uh, I normally do after a, you know a fight where there's not much happening. But um, you know I couldn't. I kind of had to take advantage of, of the fans. My first fight there, so you know I uh, I know the fans appreciate it, and you know I like getting fired up too. So um, you know I hope they hope they enjoyed that, and the place was rocking. So it was a uh, nice little experience. Well, from what I can tell from the media and from the fan base, everybody loves you. So definitely keep that up and. Uh... Hope everything goes well with the season. I uh, hope you. I uh, think you guys will pull it together. It's looking good on my end. So, um, yeah. again, thanks a lot for coming through, man. I really appreciate it. No problem, man. Thanks a lot. Thanks. See you later.